going on, folks? What is that? Oh. Loot, get in out of here. I'll take what I can. I'm a level 10 now. Woo! Took forever. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I got something I actually want to read to the viewers. It's kind of interesting. Just in case you guys don't know. Let's get to my post. To unlock exclusive fan attic school robe, a beaked skull mask, and even your own wand in Hogwarts Legacy, players need to connect their Harry Potter fan club and Warner Brothers game accounts to the game. And you get get that you know you get the a nice mask and you get a robe like the one I have on you know, just laying it out there in black and white if anyone wants to do it if they haven't heard of it you know it's always good to try uh, get more content and if you're gonna wear it so be it man I, I have the dark arts but I'm, I'm pretty content what I have on right now but make sure to check that out link your account you get free you get some freebies I don't know if this gate opens. Is it open? Tell me I'm stuck out here. All right, good. Oh. Handy resource indeed. Your I believe my next mission, since I'm a level 10 and at level 6, I was supposed to do the flying mission. And I think this is what it looks like over here. I got to go through these loops. Probably is what I'm guessing. So I'm going to learn how to fly. Like Superman. Here we go. I'm excited. It's like what I've all been waiting for here. Everybody grab a broom and we shall get started. Alright, let's do it, man. I bet I gotta fight wizards in the sky, that'd be sick. Mr. Clopton, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely. As good yeah. like this. That's not going to go good. A means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Quidditch? Not a fan, I take it? Now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. Let's do it, Both man. Stop talking already. Let's do it. Let's go. Good. Now, for your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Wish Do I had my own take word. care. 
The brooms are school <laughs> property. This I is want brilliant. them returned in one piece. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? This next set of things will take you away from the challenge. What a view! <laughs> Hello! Nice day for a flight! Where is it? Oh. Oh, this is sick, dude. Ha! Good. I've got this. Ah, oh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as a first year. Oh, this is beautiful. To be. I was in bed. Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. Mr. Clopton, I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor Enough. Class is finished for the day. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. You better. 
That was some rather good fly. Sorry about that business with Kagawa. But you have to admit, those views were worth it. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spint, which is in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. I think what I'm gonna do. I took a picture. What am I doing that for? All right, hold up. Can I ever talk? Like, I'm trying to get a new wand. How was that? Oh, I knocked the books over. What are you up to now? Shut up.
soothe my owl. I have something to show you. First, let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, you took the fall for me. That counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did, but something was missing. I'm not sure here is the best place to discuss it. Understood. We can talk more in a moment, in the Undercroft. Not even the professors know about this place. This way. There's a secret passage just here. It's well disguised. play gobstones here all the time with my sister and she loved that game what I wouldn't give to lose to her again I should tell you I swore to ominous I would safeguard this place so please keep this between us he never confides in anyone but he's trusted me since the day we met I wouldn't want to jeopardize that we used to sneak in here almost daily never been caught. I think I've seen ominous in potions. Or was it herbology? I've noticed that he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind, and no spell could reverse it. His wand seems almost sentient. Not surprising, I suppose. Ollivander always says, the wand chooses the wizard. Is that how he found this place? No, someone in his family knew about it. The Gaunts are full of secrets. I've never heard anyone else speak of it. I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, mention this to no one, especially Ominous. He has no love lost for his family or their secrets. But this place is special to him. Understood. But why does Ominous have no love lost for his family? His father's family are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Obsessed with blood status, most of them. Ominous cannot abide them, as he'll be the first to tell you. Anyway, the Undercroft has been a perfect place to sneak off to, away from prying eyes, and even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Really? Like what? Like the Blasting Curse. Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to teach students. A proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic, but you should learn it. I can teach it to you safely here. It may take a while to get the feel for it. Mimic my wand movement. The incantation is Confringo. Very well. You're getting it. Ready to actually try it out? Stick to the time. First time 
ominous amount of practice can Fringo. We singed our eyebrows. <laughs> I would have paid to see that. I swore we'd never live it down. To this day, there's something about that smell that's addictive. The blast does heat things up. <laughs> I see how you lost your eyebrows. <laughs> You'll get used to it. Anne Ominous and I used to practice down here for hours. The Undercroft was our retreat. I haven't been here in some time. It's not the same without her. I'm sorry about your sister. If there's anything I can do. Perhaps when I next head to Feldcroft, you could come along. Meet her. She could use some cheering up. Just let me know when and I'll meet you. Oh, she misses Hogwarts. She's been stuck at home with our guardian, Uncle Solomon. Unfortunately, you'll have to meet him too. Well, meeting a new student will be precisely what she needs. I shall look forward to it. Cheers. By the way, what was it you couldn't discuss out in the hall earlier? Uh, I'm not sure where to start. You said something was missing from what you found in the library. I assume it's to do with what you told me about the port key and Gringotts and Ranrock. Nothing gets past you. And yes, it is. As I'm sure you suspect, there is a bit more to all of this. I'm listening. The book I found in the restricted section was missing some pages. That's about it. Pity. Didn't think you'd disappoint me with so vague an answer. I suppose with both Rookwood and Ranrock after you. A bit more time practicing the blast and curses in order. Spend as much time here as you'd like. And remember, keep this place between us. When I head to Feldcroft, I'll send you a name. He got mad because I didn't tell him the truth. That's funny. I like the dialogue. Time for me to get out of here. <laughs>
Let's see, let's see. Quest.
<laughs> oh wow. Oh no. Must have been. You should save your wits and find out. I know there's another way to push this out, but I'm I, a little stuck here at the moment. Can I get through? Oh, I'm out. What's it doing here? What am I doing? What do I do now? Where would the elf be? Where would the elf be? I gotta find an elf. I hope that house elf can find us in here. I think I found them. Yikes! Careful! Huh? Oh, there you are. Wait right there. Deke will come to you. Hello. Ah, oh, Deke, we've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared last year. Is this the student? Indeed it is. Deke is honored to meet you. Deke has been a friend since I was a second year. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, <laughs> Professor Weasley. 
equipped for the Seeker's needs. Its unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. Deep seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them. You seem to have accessed it in its form as the room of hidden things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. <laughs> Brilliant. Well, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. Now, it's time to focus on what you need. Just close your eyes. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will do the rest. Identify unfamiliar items of clothing. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. This will be more useful when I have something to identify. You'll find
I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer in case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. I got enough of that. Return to me once you've gathered enough, and we shall begin the lesson. I have the moonstone you requested, Professor. Good. Then we may begin your lesson. You can conjure more than potions and herbology tables. Conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking. Why don't you try it on the walls and floor?
Yep. I've conjured everything I can. What's next, Professor? I think you're ready to take on alteration. The altering spell will allow you to customise any conjured item. You can change the colours, patterns and styles of your furniture to suit your taste. Let's get started, shall we? Watch closely as I demonstrate how to perform the altering spell. Damn, so many spells in this game. Oh. I have some questions about alteration, Professor. Yes? Thank you, Professor. I have no more questions. I'll be here if you need anything else.
Well, how are you, Deke? Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambience. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I would like the room to feel as if it's been lit by the moon. Hmm, sounds perfect. Damn, that's cool. All right, I think I'm going to end it here, guys. Thanks for watching and uh, watching my content. It's a pretty interesting game. Maybe I'll do like one more mission. Hold up. I got some uh, watch, a marker over here. Let me uh, pinpoint it. Pinpoint it on the map. I really wanted to buy a wand, but it won't let me, so. Professor Fig. Oh, I'm dying to check this out, so we'll see what happens. I did, and because Jackdaw had followed
map they contained. When I found the pages, I found the location on the map. Believe it or not, it's a room below Hogwarts. Why am I not surprised? Shall we? I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. Something's gonna go down. I can already feel it. Considerable skill 
and all you have already accomplished. We shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. Whilst Professor Fig may assist you in locating the trials, they may be completed only by one with our ability. Shall we have a look? I know that tower. It's not far. You may have seen it yourself. It looks familiar. <laughs> Perhaps your young friend is more well-traveled than you might think. As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join me as soon as you can. I'm gonna end it here guys. This is interesting. Very interesting game. Can't wait to venture out and see more. Um he just disappeared? Where is oh I guess he's <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna end it here. Thank you.